I walked six and a half miles today knocking doors for you. Fantastic! I talked to a lot of people today who really, really like you, but they are really scared to vote for who they like the best because they're worried that not enough people feel the same. What do we do to give people the courage to vote for who they like the best, who they think is going to do the best job? Oh, what a great question! A lot of people just want to beat Donald Trump. I get it. They just want to win. But here's the thing. Fear doesn't win. Courage and vision. Now, I've lived long enough with people who have told me what is not possible. I lived with it in 2012 when people said, you should run for the Senate, girl. You have big ideas to get out there and fight for, but you better realize you're gonna lose. Every big idea, every person who fights for a big idea gets underestimated, told how it'll never work. You can't do this, you can't make this happen. And why can't you make it happen? Because it hasn't happened before. Well, here's my view of the world. It's going to happen now because it has to happen now. This country is in a crisis, and I get it. Media pundits, Washington insiders, shoot, there are a lot of people in our own party, don't want to admit it. They think that running some vague campaign that politely nibbles around the edges of big problems in this country is the safe strategy. They are wrong. I am not running a campaign with proposals that are carefully designed not to offend rich people. And I know that makes some people nervous. I understand that. But here's the thing. I also know what's broken in this country. I am running a campaign based on a lifetime of fighting for working families. I am running a campaign from the heart because I believe that 2020 is this one moment that we can make the kind of change this country demands that we make. time to win the fight for a Green New Deal and save our planet. Our time to win the fight for Medicare for all and save our people. Our time to win the fight for a two cent wealth tax and invest in an entire generation of young Americans. The only mistake we can make is to be timid. The only mistake we can make is to let this moment pass us by. You gotta be in the fight now. It's not coming our way again. This is truly the moment in history to dream big, fight hard.